Hey guys, welcome to this week's vlog. So really quickly, Bay and I are going to lunch. It's like a champagne, champagne something, champagne something, lunch or brunch or whatever. So I wanted to vlog and I'm gonna take you guys with, but before we do that, I wanted to share with you my fragrance of the day and a little haul of some things that I recently acquired. So what I'm wearing today, I'm wearing my floral hoops, which they're sold out y'all. Thank you guys for buying them. I'm waiting for another shipment, but they are sold out currently, but they go with my outfit. I was gonna wear the Fendi earrings because I haven't worn any of my designer earrings like since getting my earrings, but the hair is just, it's so much that the earrings get lost. So once I have my hair back, then I'll be able to wear these little earrings. So I'm wearing these earrings, a white t-shirt, think it's express i'll link it it's just like a nice oversized really thin soft tee i'm wearing this orange blazer by french connection it's no longer available so i can't link it but it's an orange blazer with some blue jeans and these manolo blonic shoes you guys know i love to do a color block moment and i can walk in these shoes let me tell y'all something my feet are hurting me, okay? Because I've been wearing heels a lot lately, but I just can't stop. Because summer's about to roll around and I'm wearing heels like a lot because I'm going out more often and I don't really go out and not wear heels. Maybe once in a while, depends on what I'm wearing. It could be like a nice long maxi dress with a flat or something like that. But for the most part, your girl is in a heel. So I need to train my feet again to walk in heels. So that's what it is. And for my purse, I'm doing the Fendi sunshine tote in the medium size so with this strap that's why i'm able to wear this orange blazer and this blue shoe and this colorful ear it's all working okay it's all working so that's my outfit so my fragrance of the day y'all so i was gonna do clive christian with dolce pineapple and just do like a fresh sweet effervescent aromatic type scent but it's not that hot so i'm gonna wait on this and i decided to do a peach routine peach please which has had me in a chokehold and i layered creed windflowers with burberry my burberry black so here's the thing i didn't layer them like spray one and spray the other i sprayed the burberry on my arms and on my wrist and i sprayed the creed on my neck and like on my clothes so it's kind of a combination of the two but y'all <laughs> y'all already know so y'all already know ain't nobody smelling better than me period <laughs> so i want to show y'all a little haul of some things that i've accumulated so Bath and Body Works has gotten this lemon, iced lemon pound cake that has seemed to go on viral because I see it on everyone's timeline. So this right here, y'all, it smells so good. So I did the buy three. They weren't doing buy three, get three. When I purchased this, I got something for free from my loyalty. So I ended up getting two body creams, two body washes. I can run through these because I use a lot of body wash at one time and then the spray. So what it smells like is lemon pound cake, like a lemon cookie. <sighs> Y'all, it's so good. So if you love strawberry pound cake, listen, it smells nothing like strawberry pound cake, but it's like the lemon version to strawberry pound cake. And the thing with this, for me, I don't get a whole lot of citruses. It does smell lemony, but not super sharp lemony. It's so good, y'all. So the notes are sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, which is why it doesn't smell too lemony and citrusy and also fluffy pound cake. And that's exactly what it smells like. Y'all, this is so good. It smells like almost like um, sugar cookies or cookie something, the one that they come out with during the holiday season. This is really good. So if y'all see this, uh, mm, it's an online exclusive. So that's what I hate about Bath & Body Works. Like put everything in the store. What if somebody doesn't want to blind buy? You know what I mean? Like it's just so annoying. You can return. But just make life simple and just have everything that you have online in store as well, please. So, oh, I forgot to show y'all. So I'm wearing these glasses too. I could wear like a dark glass, but I want to wear these. So these are Gucci. I just love these because I can have something on my face to pull my look together. 
and I can see like I can wear this inside the restaurant if I wanted to because it's not dark so I love these um what else did I want to show y'all I'm going super quick because Bay's waiting for me but I wanted to film this before we left so the other day Bay and I went to Molten Brown he was shopping not at Molten Brown but he was shopping and I tagged along with him and I saw a Molten Brown store so I went in and I actually smelled the delicious rhubarb and rose fragrance y'all I've never smelled the fragrance only the body wash so I was like let me smell the fragrance y'all when I tell you it's so freaking pretty like it is so pretty let me tell y'all what it smells like if you're West Indian right or Caribbean or maybe you're not, but you just like cultural different types of foods and desserts. If you've ever smelled tamarind, like tamarind ball, it's kind of sweet, but then it has like that spiciness to it, not spicy, that sourness to it. So like, I'm just imagining eating one right now and just feel it like that sourness behind my ear. This smells like that, but so beautiful, so sweet, so fresh and tartly, y'all. This is so beautiful. Let me tell you, so I sprayed it on. And I was like, oh, this smells good. And just, you know, kept it moving and kept smelling my hand, kept smelling my hand. They loved it. So at the last minute, like I went back and got it. And I'm so happy. This smells so good. If you're looking for a sweet feminine rose that smells different, but still mass appealing and pleasing, y'all will absolutely love this. Oh, it smells so good. So delicious rhubarb and rose by Molten Brown. And then I was sent a ton of fragrances by the fragrance group. You wait for me. Oh. I was sent a ton of fragrances by the fragrance group. But I wanted to share these with you. They're by the brand Nasamoto, right? Nasomato. So this is Narcotic V. Yo, I'm doing a whole video because these are so fire. So Narcotic V. This one is Silver Musk, it's beautiful, clean, musky scent. This is what the bottles look like, they're so chic. And this one is Bar Baronda. This is what it looks like. How cute is this cap? Like the whole concept of these fragrances is just so amazing. And I just wanted to show y'all this really quickly, but I'm gonna have them in another video, maybe like a PR haul or something like that. I think I'm gonna do like a massive PR haul because I have so many PR fragrances to share with y'all. So I also purchased the Dove Exfoliating Body Polish in the Cherry Scent, the Crushed Cherries, and Chia Milk Scent. I got two of them. Y'all, this smells so sweet. Okay, so y'all know how y'all was telling me, somebody said Dove came out with a cherry body wash, it's better than the Tarte Cherry by Degree, thank me later. So I was like, hmm, really? thank me later but it was never in stores like I couldn't see it in stores so I was just like you know what I don't feel like doing a pickup or like a drive like a pay for a pickup that day so I was like whatever but I did see the soap in my supermarket I saw the the bar soap so I did buy that and it smells good it's not super fragrant but it's fragrant enough um so I bought a pack of that and I did like it so finally I ended up getting the body wash and it does smell good the thing is I didn't want to blind buy the body wash because sometimes with Dove like it says crushed cherries and chia milk i didn't know what the chia milk was gonna give because dove has a ban not banana uh, um the bananas on my mind <laughs> dove has a mango body wash that has like an almond butter like why would you put almond butter with mango like why why <laughs> so it just does not smell good i have it i'm using it because i don't want to waste it but it literally turns my stomach i hate it like it should have just been a nice juicy sweet mango but i feel like the almond milk or the almond butter it like it messed it up so i wasn't sure if that was going to be the same vibe with the cherries but it does smell really good but what i will say the cherry scrub because that one isn't open i opened this one so i want to smell it the cherry scrub it's very, um, this one is number two, like it's a moderate scrub. So it's more like a body polish instead of a scrub. So you're really just getting the, oh, listen to me when I tell you, cause I'm getting sidetracked. Okay, the consistency is very, like can y'all see, it's super liquidy. It's really not like, it's not giving scrub. It's giving some type of a body milk or body polish or whatever. But because it smells so good, like it's so super strong way more scented than the um 
Oh, he's in the garage. He turned the car on. He's ready to go, y'all. Way more scented than the body wash. Um, so yeah, that's that. And I wanted to show y'all this dress. So one thing about me, I love getting dressed up, okay? Like that's what I do when I'm going on a date night. For the majority of the time, especially in the spring and the summer, I love wearing dresses. I love being really extra. That's just me. So I love the brand Retrofit because I love sequins. But it's sequins done so different from like your regular sequins that you may be thinking of, like super bright, shiny. It's sequins and it's shiny, but it's still kind of like muted and it's not undetectable like you see it but it's not like whoo like girl like the whole block can see you you know what i mean like it's just a beautiful classy sequence and i'm obsessed with them and they have such beautiful colors it's a robe style you know what i mean so it's a robe like you can eat you don't have to worry about wearing spanks that day you can eat you can get bloat it doesn't matter because it's a robe so it's kind of loose but still sexy but listen it's just everything so I saw this color on Netta Porte and I had to pick it up. I will link it for you guys because I think it's still in stock. But y'all, look at the... It's not even showing up how beautiful this is. This is so freaking gorgeous, y'all. Like, it's so pretty. This color is everything. I will say these dresses are pricey. But I feel like... Not I feel like. They're definitely worth it. Like, point blank, period. They're showstoppers. I feel so feminine, so sexy. I don't have to wear a spank because it's not like bodycon, it's loose. I can wear it as like a robe with jeans. Here's the thing, so this is an extra large. So the extra larges I wear as dresses because I can wrap it and it's enough wrap and I feel really comfortable. If I'm thirsty, if I'm thirsty, I will get the large because I just wear it with a t-shirt or a tank top and jeans and just wear it over jeans. So it doesn't have to be super wrapped. It's a little bit open but like by the crotch area, but it's cool because I'm wearing jeans. Now the dress, it can't be open or even giving me like slightly open. Like I want to be comfortable. So the extra large is perfect to wrap enough, but it's still short. It's still cute. It's still sexy. Like this color is everything y'all. It's so pretty. So I want to show y'all that. So like I said, he has turned on the car. He is in the garage. I'm going to go. I will see y'all in the car. Y'all, I was about to get left. He said he was waiting downstairs for me and then I heard the car go off like he backed the car out of the garage he was about to leave me why got time so you was about to go to the champagne brunch in the igloo and eat by yourself sipping with bae sipping by with myself <laughs> y'all right. i was really about to get left messing with y'all but anyway so we're on our way and i'm starving and i'm super excited i cannot wait because i want to have a champagne brunch honey it's not that warm outside, but it's not cold. But like I said, it's heated inside of the igloo. So that's gonna be cool. And yeah, no, what's your scent of the day? Right now? Yeah, the day. I got on Tizzy. What Tizzy? tizzy what Tizzy you got on? Orion. 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 Get out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that Yo, right he could butcher a name like it ain't nothing. No matter, I know I got that tizzy. You know you got. I know I period. got that tizzy. And do. And what? And do. And how? Period. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So we gonna ride because I know he wanna listen to music. Thank you. So he gonna turn up the music, and I'll see y'all when we get to the restaurant. Deuces. Peace.
it's super sexy in here but we're gonna come back at night because this is gonna be over it's like these whole igloos and it looks like it's sponsored by Wolf Clico champagne so it's super sexy super chic but we're gonna come back at night because it's like 60 degrees right now which would typically be kind of cold that's why i'm in a blazer but i could have had on like a off the we, shoulder we gonna come back at night because it's gonna shut down in three days it's gonna shut down in three days and the sun is gonna be like not around but not out so it'll be cooler because it is it's warm because i'm about to take my blazer off but i'm just still trying to look cute but the blaze is about to come off all right so, y'all, it's really hot in here <laughs> because this isn't something that they do in the summer or like in the spring. It's mainly the winter and like the tail, like the tail end of winter into spring, like the days that it's still cold. Because this igloo, it's not plastic; it's like acrylic, but it holds the heat. So you, you can fry an egg on my head right now. <laughs> here we are. Right, Thank right. you. Not a problem. Give you guys a few moments. To take Thank a look you. I thought it was a little breach. I just, it still got the Betsy Rose. That's you gonna get? I don't know. Oh, it's the same it's stuff? Not. Passion fruit margarita? Is that new? Sounds good. I didn't see it before. They have a French 76. Pomegranate crush. Is that new? I want to see what that is. I'm sure you can make it look. It's black. Anything catch your eye? Yeah, I'm gonna have the French 76. Not a problem. The uh, pomegranate crush, does that have liquor in it? Yeah, um, kettle uh, citrus vodka is the base of that. Oh, it's vodka. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I have that. Okay, wonderful. Yeah. It's actually not, it's getting better in here. No. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. It's, it's, um, not too much ice. Yeah, not a problem at okay. all. No. Yeah. <laughs> Alright y'all, so we're about to eat. I'm in here now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blocking. I'm I'm frying. You guys gotta be careful. Exactly. I'm joined by the owners. Oh, I'm joined by the Thanks for coming in. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Thanks again. <laughs> Alright y'all, so we're about to eat. And Bay doesn't want to vlog and eat. He's different. So we gonna eat and I'm gonna talk to y'all a little bit later. Okay. Are you gonna be? Say that you're gonna be. What I did last night I came home Say around a quarter to three Still so high Hypnotized In a trance From this body So buttery brown And tantalizing You would have thought I needed help From this feeling that I felt So shook I had to catch my breath It does. It period. End up. Period. Who the fuck are you? Period. Oh boy, you in the shades that I got you for crema. You got your crema shades or you thinking you doing it in your crema shades. If not me, then you. If not now, then when? Come on, your crema shades. Merry crema. Merry crema. <laughs> Hold on, wait a minute. Y'all thought I was finished. Okay, so Bay and I are having this conversation just about like men and women in general. And I was like, you know what? We should vlog this. This is a good conversation. The people might want to hear this. Well, Don't mind me because I forgot my lipstick. So, what, what men are, is it attractive? Yeah, because you was like the men with the chase and everything. So, we were just talking about men and relationships why do we start talking about that i don't know but he was dropping some jewels like he's always dropping jewels and i feel like y'all could probably benefit from some of these jewels too so drop the jewels i mean i was just saying oh no, now he no, no 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 all right i was just saying that men are attractive to the chase attracted attractive Attracted. Attract whatever. Men are attracted three days, to the chase. You know what I'm saying? So it's not about oh I called her, she called me right back. Right. You know what I'm saying? 
You oh. have to be unavailable. Oh, I told her to come through. She came through. Right. You know Be what I'm busy. saying? Even when you ain't got nothing to do. So now it's like, oh, she ain't nobody. You know what I'm saying? Wait, it's wait. just another <laughs> whatever. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but a woman that give you resistance, it's like, damn, why? And why, it's not why, even why playing. Why not hollering? It's at? not even playing games or playing hard to get. It's just. So 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 it's like, all right, boom. If you've been to. I don't know. I guess say a place that we occasionally visit. Visit Dubai. If you if you've been to Dubai before, and it's it's a guy he might have, you know. He got a little chain. He got a little chain. He got a little chain. You know what I'm saying? And then he's like, oh no, I mean, you know, go on trips, take you to Dubai. You know what I'm saying? Get you my right. nice little car, whatever car he's driving, or whatever. Been there, done that. I got a good car too, bro. Even if you haven't been there. And you're like, oh, oh, that's nice. I've been there before. Now he got to step his game up, or All take a step up. back All and, be, the and reanalyze up. the whole situation, and be like, all right. So she, it ain't about my she money. Wanna, she ain't one of them. She ain't one of them. Right. It ain't about my money. If she like me, she like me for, for me. me. You know what I'm saying? So it's always the pursuit. But y'all call it uh, a chase? No, 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 courting. Courting, yeah. That's courting. what y'all call call it, courting. So when a man sees there's resistance from a woman, and he's he'll he'll start courting you. He'll open doors for you. He'll take you to nice dinners. You know, he'll take you out. He'll he'll he he may even drop you home at a respectable time. You know. Not make, not make even. No, so wait, wait, no, hold no, up. No, no, so I'm what was saying, he about to do? With? I'm saying, I'm saying, open doors, open legs, whatever. Not, not, not make even. Yeah, whatever. You was driving me home at a decent hour. I know. I was courting. You ain't even know where I live, child. I, I was courting. No, I, I ain't know where you live for like six months. True story. Anywho. Anywho. Yeah. Period. But you know, you have to put the desire. To a man in order for him to light the flame. And it's not about it's playing, it's not about playing games. Because so people think like, oh, that's playing games. I want to be real with him. Like if I ain't doing nothing, I want to hang out. No, like if you're not busy, like reorganize your perfume. Reorganize your pantry. Like do something because Listen, you never want to be available to a man all the time. It will be times that they will call me. Oh, you you want to hang out, you want to go to dinner and trust me. When you say food and dinner, yeah, like she, she wanna go. I wanna go. She I wanna get go. dressed up. I wanna <laughs> smell good. I wanna eat. But it took everything out of me to be like, oh no, not tonight. No we good and well, I ain't doing nothing. But you have to appear. She, she played the cause, right? You have to appear. But then when I became like when I realized, oh, okay, like he's like real. Yeah, and, because now because now it's and, like, oh, you then I was somebody always else. Free, girl. So, I was so now, always free. So, so now to the dude, he, like, oh, you seeing somebody else? Mm, 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 I gotta step my game up because I don't know what this exactly. dude brings to the table. I'm offering to take her to Dubai. This dude might be like, let's go to Paris for lunch. Exactly. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, let me step my game up, and that's what and, and, hold guys on, hold will on. do. Your money game ain't gotta be like that. So it ain't all about money. No. And I'm I'm talking directly to the fellas. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Court the woman is court the woman. You could buy flowers. That's so, like. Thirty dollars. You know, it doesn't send, matter. Send her son to a job. Buy her whatever. perfume or give her a her gift card. At, you know, don't don't look like a stalker. Right, don't look like a stalker. Don't look like a stalker. You know what I mean? You wanna you wanna gather the information before you start doing stuff. You make you look like you you know what I mean? Sitting in the garbage can waiting for her to get home. Oh you god. Know what I mean, you don't want me in the garbage can waiting for her to get home. We ain't talking about that. Talking about courting, and you're attracted to a woman, and that's what you want to get. That's who you want in your life. That's who you want in your that's, life. That's, that's that's your trophy. That's your trophy. Um, that's your trophy. I'm lost. Oh, Lord, I got I got a little. I got a little. You 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 got a little.
I love mine. You got to get your own, dog. You got to get your own, yeah? All right, y'all. So now the vlog is over, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Yeah. I know we just signed the deal, but I need my advance on the next one, too. They know I'm going to be Yeah. I need it. Retro Boomer and want some more. Cause I got a really big team and they need some really